Okay, so we have to cut uh, this piece of plastic a bit thinner so it will go through the extruder. Actually, I will show you first time the wrong way to do it. See, this is a bit too thick. And I'll show you what, uh, what is gonna happen. I never seen this uh, shown online, so I thought I'll put the ugly part from behind the scene. See, because it's too thick, it will not go through the nozzle. It just crumples there. See? Okay, so I'm gonna cut this part. Now I'm gonna cut this really thin. See, this is the thickness. Once you put it through, it's gonna start melting very fast, so you need some pliers to grab it. Okay, and then pull a bit. And it will just go through. Okay, now I'm gonna put it through this. It's just a piece of plastic with three holes. Two holes will not hold. But I'm still showing you. You have to use all the three holes for a very tight fit. Once I managed to make it uh, stick even through two holes but uh, I recommend going through the three. That's what I'm using it now. Okay, so now I'm gonna go to Octoprint and starting. And wait for it. Okay, let's use all the three holes now. Yeah, I might make one with four holes, so <laughs> it's easier to put through. Okay, now this is good enough to hold. Let's tighten up this a bit. I think it's better if, if I would use... Uh, I made Actually, I made an upgrade since I made a video. And uh, I put a screw with a nut, holds much better and doesn't unscrew. Okay, now it pulls very nicely. I just keep the rest of the plastic on the floor. Let me show you.
Yes, this one is really a game changer. You can use it in the bedroom. <laughs> It was just fine like this, it just pulls up as it feeds through. Okay, so this is the end. Okay. All the filament went through. Let's stop the machine. Now I'll show you how I take it off. Just remove the nut. Slip the tensioner to the side. So I can remove the belt as well. Okay, so now the drum is free. Just let the the filament release a bit and pull it out on of the drum. Okay, put it back and ready for another one.